Hi ladies, welcome back to the channel. I'm Yanka, the excellent wife and mom, and I am so glad that you're here. Um, in this video, I'm just gonna go over the things that we've done or what we've been doing um, for the last week and a couple of days. So like, I think it's the 23rd through now, and now it's the last day of October. I cannot believe how fast this month has gone. But um, we've been, uh, well, the boys, my husband used to water the chickens or give them the water, fill the little containers up. So now my boys took over that job, so they've been doing that. Um, we've um, been um, planting the leaves because it's fall here. So the kids really love that. So there's a bunch of leaf piles around, so they've been uh, planting the leaves. Um, we've been reading through, so we're still going through the book of Pro Proverbs. So afterwards, we, you know, we always read, we have discussions, and then they, um, we play uh, hangman with one of the verses, so they really like that. And the uh, we've been the boys have been working on division, so we introduced that um, last week. But they loved that, so that was great. And then you know, still reviewing, going through multiplication and subtraction and addition and all that stuff. Um, the all of them they they enjoy cooking especially my little one and so she made some muffins i think a couple of days ago and you know she's always in the kitchen always helping with something and we've been taking walks so we we go for like morning walks because i like to get some form of physical activity to kind of start the day to settle everybody down and just you know so we can kind of focus a little bit so we go on these walks around the neighborhood usually and so along the way uh, they'll jump on the trampoline, they skateboard, and you know, we see different neighbors. And so <laughs> it's a nice way to kind of start your day. And uh, we go to the park as well. So around 1.30ish, two o'clock, we'll go to the park on, usually on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And um, I like to walk. So I have a small walking group that I, uh, my friends who like join me for a walk, or sometimes I go by myself. But um, so I really enjoy like, walking especially outdoors so i've been doing it while the kids been playing and then on wednesdays there's another there's a homeschool group there so they've been playing with those kids from that homeschool group um we've been oh we of course we've gone to the library i think we took a trip last week once or twice but you know we returned books and got new books and they um actually they had so before the pandemic they there was this little family that we used to always do everything with because they were homeschooled too and there was a little boy the same age as my boys so he was like their best friend and he um splits his time between his uh father here and his mother so that you know two sets of homes but we hadn't seen him in a long time and so he walked to the library uh the day we were there and he was so cute he started like oh my gosh so they got to play with him a couple of days because we were at the library and they got to you know play and talk and catch up and then the next day they were at the park the same park we go to so they got to catch up with him and play so that was really cool and he's still homeschooled as well um the, of course uh we're still the boys are still practicing their instruments the girls as well um Oh, yeah, the girls have been pointing out the places we've gone on a map. So it was a little fun game. Like, you know, where's the place that we went to with, you know, such and such? And they go point it out. Okay. So that's been a kind of little fun game. Um, Friday, we did a hike with a family friend. And that was about three miles. And it was so pretty. And it was so fun. And, um, you know, the thing about being out in nature like that, you know, you have just it's a playground it's a welcoming field so the kids they just it's like they know what to do all the trees are there it's very inviting so they were you know running they were climbing trees they were going to explore this you know playing on broken tree <laughs> trunks that fell and just had a great time so I, I do enjoy hiking especially in the fall and spring those are our two favorite times so we did that um and then on that night they uh that, or that evening a family friend, they had a broken cabinet at the house. So the boys got to help repair that. And, you know, they used the power drill. They were so happy. They were so, so very happy to do that. So that was um, good and a fun learning experience. Um, the, oh, my baby girl's birthday, my baby, my baby, baby. She turned uh, four, no, five yesterday. 
And so that's kind of a big birthday. And like now I'm, I'm like really out of toddler years and it's just, uh, she's growing so much. All of them are growing. I just want to, you know, really enjoy the moments. I was talking to this lady today, we were at the park and I was just like, you know, I'm, I tr try to enjoy every moment of being with my kids. Like every last moment, I do not take these moments for granted. We were all laying in the bed the other day and I was, just, my little baby girl, she was like, my man just loves being with you. <laughs> you. You know, just, she's so sweet. Just always so loving, always giving compliments. Just a sweet little girl. And I was like, I know I love you too. And I'm so happy that I get to be with you all day, every day. It's like the best thing in life. And you know, all the kids just laying and we're all just in there together. And I was just taking in the moment, you know, just being able to be a part of them, you know, to watch all of their moments, um, just, you know, just to um, grow together, to always be together, to see the things they're interested in and just love on each other and them get to be a part of the things that my husband and I do. We were all, we all went to three of the businesses today. So, you know, just living life together. And I just really not, that caused me to just always pause and thank God for his goodness, you know. That is the absolute goodness of God that my kids can't be home. And the lady I was talking to today, we were talking about that. Just, you know, having that ability to just be here with the kids. Because it's a small, it's a short season. You know, it, it is. You only have kids for the first 18 years. And then that's it. That's it. You know, those, and I look now, my, you know, baby and toddler years have gone. They're, it's history. And I don't get those back. And then they're, you know, bigger and being more independent now. But I'm enjoying the stage too, just enjoying it all. And, you know, people always tell me that I have great kids, I have sweet kids, I have amazing, and they really are. And I take no credit whatsoever for it. It's all God all the way through. Because they really are just amazing kids. And I'm so grateful for them. Um, oh, and my boys, they uh, got their own YouTube channels. And it's so cute. Like my oldest one, my 10 year old, he's like, Oh, this is a dream come true. I want to do this for, like, I think he said two years or something. Like, so he was just, you know, yesterday he told me that in the day, he said, Mom, I'm so happy that I got to do my YouTube channel. I'm like, child, I'm happy for you. <laughs> so, you know, it's just like things like that, that um, I just, I'm so grateful to uh, witness and be a part of. It's such a grace, you know, from God, I think, to be able to be with your children and just to appreciate, you know, the moments. Because, you know, as much as we spend time together, they still have their moments on their own. And I was telling them this, I said, you know, I love, I absolutely love being with you guys. And even when we're not just in the same room, because most of the day we are, you know, you go upstairs, they follow you up, like little ducklings follow you upstairs. I come downstairs, they follow me downstairs. They're just, you know, always with you somewhere very near. And I just think that's so endearing. And even when they're, you know, I may be in the kitchen cooking or something and they're in another room playing. I just, I'm listening to their conversations. I'm enjoying the laughter and just the all together good time that they have. And my husband's telling me, he said, you know, I get up at night and I just go in their rooms and I look at them, you know, I just watch them sleep. And he said, they just, you know, he said, they're, I'm so grateful they just enjoy life. They have no worries about anything and they just enjoy being kids. You know, and he appreciates that. And I feel the same way, you know, it's just, it's an honor and a privilege just to watch kids and just to wonder and, the, and they, you know, go out and they just want to learn how to do things. They just, you know, just so inquisitive about everything. You know, it's a, it's a new experience and I'm just so grateful that I get to be a part of that. So now that I've talked your ear off, that's kind of what we've been doing and also what I'm thankful for. <laughs> And so, yeah, that's, that's it. Oh, yeah, like I said, the boys been skateboarding. Um, my daughter, oh, grandma bought her new skateboard. So uh, we've kind of been doing a lot of skateboarding, um, trampolining. You'll see that. So I'll, it'll be a short video, uh, probably the day after this comes out of just all our little activities. So uh, that's it. That's all I've, um, oh, I, my girls, they play this little bean toss game. I wrote a few things down that, you know, totally made up game and they totally enjoy it. So I love that imagination of kids, you know, and I said, you know, always keep it alive because God put that there and we can't imagine to do, but that's where, you know, you meet God. And I think the creativity from God is there in your imagination. So anyway, thanks for watching. God bless you. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.